Hello students and others watching. My name is Miss Marissa. Welcome to Create With Me, where today I'll be showing you guys the vision board that I made for myself for the new year of 2022. And hopefully it inspires you guys to do the same. It's very beneficial and it helped me set my goals for the new year. Um, one thing that I focused on is my short term and my long term. So for my short term, I decided to focus on exercise because I feel like it's very good for your mental health, um, as well as reading more. I want to read more about a whole bunch of things that you can learn about, if that makes any sense. One of my long-term goals is investing, and so I guess that would kind of go with my short-term goal. I would read about investing, about stocks, and how to save your money, and um, other people uh, I can read about the experiences that other people I've went through. So one of my long terms would be investing, learning how to invest, and then my short term would kind of, would connect with that, which would be reading. Another long term goal of mine would be to finish my first year of college with my full credit. That that that's a very good long term goal, I would say. And I in the beginning, one of my long term goals was to redesign my house. But then as I was doing the project, I changed one of my long-term goals to eating more healthy because I feel like that was more reasonable. That would that would best benefit me. So within my vision board, I put a, a song title and it means something to me because the song is kind of talking about self-love and I feel like that's very important. That's something that I really want to focus on in the new year. So I added that to my vision board. Your vision board is something, it, it's your vision. So. Whatever you want to focus on in the new year, whatever is a goal that you want to set, that's what you put on. Once I had my short term and my long term goals written on a sheet of paper, I grabbed another sheet of paper in which I kind of outlined how I visioned my vision board to look like just so I know where to place everything. Once that was done, I just started drawing everything. It was kind of very therapeutic for me just because I enjoy drawing. Then here I am cutting it all out. I left about an inch out between everything that I drew and then here I'm outlining my investment that I kind of vision and then I went and painted that in I filled that in with all white and then here I am outlining the year 2022 with Mod Podge and then I'm gonna grab some glitter put that over the Mod Podge so that all the glitter goes over the glue then after that I just began drawing everything coloring everything and outlining everything Vision boards are tools used by people all over the world to assist with clarifying, concentrating, and manifesting focus on specific goals, which is why I chose to begin with this for the new year of 2022. It can also help you gain an understanding of what you want and how you want to get there. Because I outlined about an inch of all my drawings, after I cut that out, I went ahead and put Mod Podge around that and put glue over that. Here I am doing it again. And then I kind of just got carried away and decided to put glitter everywhere because that's what I like. Once that was done, I went ahead and put it side by side, my board and my paper that I had imagined. And I just put everything in place. Some things didn't go as planned, but that was okay. I just ended up changing my mind throughout the time that I had to think about everything. So then I went ahead and glued the back of each one. But instead of actually putting glue, I didn't want to put too much pressure because I had glitter on the other side. I didn't want too much glitter to fall out. So I went ahead and grabbed a brush and then that's how I glued it. Here goes my vision board. I hope everybody enjoyed the video. I highly encourage you all to create a vision board as well as it really did help me think of ways I can achieve these goals.